All right, friends, it's been Christmas. I got some presents already, as you can see on my head. Got some 3M headphones. Can connect to Bluetooth and everything on these, so that's really nice. I won't have to put the little foam earplugs in every time. Just plop these on, that'll be nice. We got the maple, some of it home. At least there's still a lot there to get. So that's here. I went out and looked at a truck today decided it was a little too rusty for me but i'm still looking still looking can't call gloves winter gloves these will keep my hands real warm so we are gonna get splitting in here we got the light on in the pallet shed that i built myself here we got maple we're gonna get splitting this beautiful stuff it splits open pretty nice most of it if it's not naughty it's nice you get a split and stacked. So here we go. Let's get the splitter on. Usually in the summer when it's warm out, this thing takes one or two pulls and it's on. But in the winter, sometimes it takes up to like 10 pulls. It's pretty cold out today. I wonder how many pulls it's going to be today. Let's figure out. Whoa. We're getting there.
Hey, did you see that one piece? <laughs> now those pieces that came out of that I will be burning for myself. No way in heck would I sell one of those. Ugh, just so ugly and gross. Well, there's our wheelbarrow full. When the wheelbarrow gets full, we stop splitting and we go and we stack. So we walk right out here, right around our white oak here, to where we're stacking currently, right here. There we are. So that's what I do. I just split into here until the wheelbarrow is full, turn the splitter off, come out, and stack. And back to in how insane this piece is. <laughs> Just look at this. Just, no one wants to deal with this. This is, <laughs> that's nasty. Look, there's just frozen crud in there. It's just, this will be for me to burn. It'll burn hot and it'll burn slow in a couple of years once it's dry. But no one, don't give this to people because they don't want it. No one wants to deal with this. You guys know that. So, onward with the splitting. We got a really windy day today. It's really cold. I had to tune the saw because it's so cold it needed tuning. So I think I got it tuned up right. So my tripod broke so it was like really hard to get it to sit right. So I didn't do much filming of this but I got a new one now. So this is what I got done. Uh, we got some limb wood up here. Big limb wood still needs to go. So we're gonna film that. And then we got a tree to drop. That one that's leaning. Sorry about the wind. I don't even know if you can even hear me, but I'm going to get you set up and we're going to get this done.
All right, not sure how much of you that you saw because I think my phone shut off because it got too cold, but I'm going to try and get on film the felling of this tree. Now I'm gonna do something special while felling this tree because I think there is danger for a barber chair with this tree because the weight is, there's just so much lean, so much weight going the exact way it's going to be felled that I think it's gonna barber chair. So what I'm gonna do is a bore cut right next to my notch and then go back. And I, that will eliminate the chance of a barber chair. Not much of a hang up, there's that I gotta worry about. I'm gonna be backing away from this once it's going down. But uh, I'll probably cut it right above this mess, probably right there. Notch, back cut. So I'll get you set up and we'll get this tree down. All right, friends, got it down. This is what we got done. Cleaned up the top and everything. Uh, chain is dull and I have to start heading home. So I'm gonna get the trailer loaded up, get those rounds up in there, and I'm gonna get going. And it is precipitating out. And I, I'm driving a two wheel drive Kia Sorento. So, uh, I wonder if I'm going to be able to get out of here, but uh, I'm going to give it a shot. I might have to unload some, but we'll see what happens.